CGNU, we're located on your dial at 93.7 FM, and you can also find us on the web at cjnu.ca. Our bigger overarching role is as a community station. We're a totally Winnipeg-based station. We have 1,200 members. It's a very sizable co-op now, one of the larger co-ops in Manitoba. And uh, we're an independent voice. We can, we can tell it as we see it here in Winnipeg. CG News is a remarkable story. I'm a lifelong Winnipegger, and as you can see, I'm, I'm getting on in my years, in my mature years. And it's a station that really celebrates the mature audience. And at last count, there's several hundred thousand of us, 50 plus in Winnipeg. And I think it's a station that we can relate to because it's relevant both on the music and the message side of things. We want Winnipeg to know that we are your community station. We exist because we are in your community trying to support whatever you happen to do at the local level. It could be a charity, it could be a church group, whatever it happens to be, we're here to support you. We're, we're very nomadic in design, uh, unlike a lot of radio stations where we don't spend most of our time in the studio, we spend it out in the community. And we like to take our message and our people right out in the community so we can understand the fabric of what's happening and report that news and that story and that information. I, I like to call us the Traveling Gypsy Radio Station. We are somewhere different every month um, with you guys, the Winnipeg Foundation, uh, Winnipeg Harvest, Heart and Stroke, just tons of different people in the community. I think that it's so important. The volunteers that come out of uh, the homes in Winnipeg are incredible on a ratio basis, probably tops in Canada. It's a great community and uh, volunteers make it happen. Without them, there would no, be no CJNU. Um, we're basically volunteer run. So, yeah, that's, that's it really. If there were no volunteers, we wouldn't exist. Oh, please tune in and listen to CJNU. The music is beautiful. Um, brings back old memories and I remember when we were at Grand Park a young couple came in and they said their two-year-old and three-year-old enjoy our music because it calms him so there you go it's a nostalgia radio station it's community based we're on 93.7 try it you'll love it I don't care what age you are <laughs>